Now with a look at how some college athletes are cashing in on social media popularity. It's not the future star of the NBA or NFL, but cheerleaders being called cheer celebrities. It's a story we first saw on the New York Times and Kaylee Hartong is back with the details. Hey Kaylee. Hey, Michael, I love watching those college cheerleaders tumble and twist in ways that defy gravity. But despite that athleticism, they don't have to play by the same rules as other college athletes. So they're creating their own brand of Instagram influencing. They're called cheerlebrities. <laughs> cheerleaders with massive online followings. I have 428,000 followers on Instagram. Making big bucks through lucrative partnerships. Crocs is one of them, Reebok, Johnson Johnson. Two of the most popular cheer celebrities today, Jamie Andrews and Shannon Woolsey, both champions of the sport, cashing in sizable paychecks every month. I've definitely made a significant part of my income month to month based off sponsored posts. With my sponsorships, I easily take in with like a couple thousand a month for sure. When people see a celebrity on social media, they think, oh, like they're getting paid loads of money to promote this. But when they see someone who's less famous, but you know, still recognizable, um, promoting a product is, it's just more, I, the word that's thrown around a lot is uh, authentic. And brands think that they're more kind of persuasive in terms of promoting the product. They can sign these profitable deals because unlike other college sports like football and basketball, cheerleading is not regulated by the NCAA. So the strict rules prohibiting amateur athletes from making money do not apply. After mounting pressure, the NCAA's rules are expected to change by the next academic year, allowing all college athletes the chance to earn endorsement dollars. Go, go. Cheer celebrities, meanwhile, will keep flipping over backwards to promote themselves, but still won't get the benefits that those athletes do. We didn't have the ability to receive full ride scholarships. We didn't have the same training that the athletic department received. <laughs> People have absolutely no idea what cheerleaders really do. I just would say to them that they have absolutely no idea and that they just need to come watch a practice. <laughs> Now, the NCAA is expected to vote on that rule change in January, and when college athletes do get that right to make sponsorship dollars, they can look to those cheer celebrities for their social media tips. Right, Michael? Oh, yes, they will. I'm pretty sure. Kaylee, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.